Woo. Check out Pizza's Christ. It's pretty awesome. A little photo session. Here, get the sign like one. <laughs> He's trying to go to Idaho. And God wouldn't pull over. He hit a puddle right in front of me. Look at this. It's got a button that says press. And I'm pressing it and nothing happens. Why does it say press? <laughs> this is a big deal. This is Monster Madhouse. Guess who we found at the American Film Institute, otherwise known as the AFI? It's Peaches Christ. Hi. Oh my God. I can't believe I'm standing in such a, a fine establishment. The most feared and powerful and hated city in the world. Washington, D.C. Yes. There's a lot of money here. Money. A lot of missiles. I think it's beautiful. Missiles. And terrible fashions. Oh, oh my God. God. That's why I try to keep up with the latest. You're fashionable. That all changed when you landed here today. Oh, Fashion has made a whole new thing. I like to dress like a seven-year-old wants to. You know what I mean? Right. <laughs> <laughs> it's fantastic. Yes. This movie. Yes. All about evil. Is it all about evil? I think it really is. Evil. evil wins. Evil is celebrated. It's all about evil. Is it a horror film? It is the kind of horror film I grew up loving. Sometimes it's what you don't see that scares the crap out of you. It's true. It's weird. Today, horror film means something new, I think, to a new generation. It does. Um, but I would say it's a black comedy set in the world of an old horror movie. <laughs> it's a horror movie like a Vincent Price movie. Right. That's is it. That freaks me out. It's not like a, a modern day horror film. It's what you can't see coming up behind you that's scary. Do you know scary. what freaks me out? What? Flashlights? That camera angle. Let's take a quick look at a couple pieces of equipment that might flash us back okay, into, yeah. let's say, the 70s. This this feels like it was staged, but it was really here already. This is a real theater, this, yes. This simplex projector down here. Right, look at this. This is actually the same projector that is featured in the projection booth at the theater in All About Evil. It's an old wow. simplex. Isn't this incredible? This is heavy metal right here, people. Yeah. This is the real deal. These carbon projectors were what everyone used. This is where movies come from, kids. Yep. Right here. <laughs> and when we went into the theater, we discovered that they were using these projectors. And so the art department and I decided to put them in the movie. This movie? Yes. OK, the movie. The movie. Yes, when the movie was finished. Have you ever had the chance to actually hold the movie in your hand? Have you ever done that? And you know, the reel of film and hold it and go, look, it's a movie. Yes. I did touch it when it was all finished and I actually carried it. It's mine. It wasn't shot on film. <laughs> I carried the movie. I have held the source material, which is now locked in a vault in San, in San Francisco, that every version of All About Evil will, will have come off the creation of that. That's a good thing about a movie. Did you have to wear one of those radiation suits when you were around? No. <laughs> you know what's funny is they just they, they just handed it to me. Your favorite monster movie? Tarantula. Oh, that's a I love that one. That's a great one. One of my all-time favorites. And I love giant insects. Science movies gone wrong. Right. The wasp woman. There's always a monster. The monster is someone who started human. That's a horrible combination, though. A wasp and a woman. Yeah. Oh, I man. love the wasp woman. She sort of Pure transforms. Evil. Yeah, she becomes evil. Roger Corman. Yes. Right. Be careful what you wish for, ladies. Can you imagine? I see, I originally thought that woman was about a bunch bunch of uh, white ladies sitting around in a country club in <laughs> Bel Air or something. That's um, right. Night of the Lepus. Um, have you ever seen that one where the rabbits are... Um... The giant Gila monster. Oh, yes. amazing. One more piece of equipment we need to take a look at. Okay. Follow us. Follow us. Walk. Walk this way. <laughs> this is what they used to make movies on. Isn't it gorgeous? Right. This you is... know, when I learned, I studied film production, and we actually learned how to edit on one of these things. Wow. That's how old I am. Lucky I started you. making movies when I was three. Now, if people made movies, had to make them like this, these days you'd see about 99% less filmmakers out there. <laughs> For real. Because this is a whole art. It's especially when you got to turn all these, I don't even know what it does. Yeah. But it can also make pasta in one of these things. Yeah, too. you can just grind it out. Like if you if you're not inspired to make a film for a couple weeks, you just sort of you know whip up some pasta. If you're Italian, uh, where can fans go to write to you and find out all about Peaches Christ? Well, uh, we have a website, peacheschrist.com. Imagine that. Mm. And I have a newsletter and a fan club there, and we have a store where you can buy stuff and. Actually, you can write to me from there. <laughs> and then, of course, you know, everyone's on Facebook. Follow the stream. You yeah. gotta follow the stream. Isn't yeah. that what it's all about? Yeah, right, exactly. <laughs> well, of, I met you on Facebook. That's right. Facebook.com slash Peaches Christ. Are you, yeah, still FB. On, are you still on MySpace, too? I think I am. I like MySpace. You I know what? I'm spending more time on MySpace now. You, you know are. why? You know why? why? Because I'm getting stalked. 
you are, are on you? Facebook. Aren't you? Well, yeah, oh, but on. I don't. I like it. Uh, you know, Mr. Lobo. Sign of the Wolf. Yes. Oh, yeah. Horrors, I Mr. love Lobo. Mr. Lobo. Mr. Lobo is another great associate of ours. We're coming to get you, Lobo. Huh. He's a bad guy sometimes. Yeah, he's kind of a bad he guy. He can be. He's a villain. Yes. With the Monster Madhouse. Lobo. That's his real name, though. That's the scary I know, part. Isn't that weird? He is scary. Mr. Lobo. Coming to get you, Mr. Lobo. <laughs> Watch yes. Yourself. Lobo. It is great it's to great finally to meet, meet you. you. Wow, look you. at all of them. Oh my I God. Know. Monster Madhouse, live with Peaches Christ at the American Film Institute. Bye. Monster Madhouse.